Hi friends, the Skillpedia presents you new complete new series on Ansible and uh, if you want to access the complete you know notes and handouts on this th this is first lecture Ansible tutorial or uh, introduction in lab setup so to understand step by step instructions and to follow the labs uh, you can uh, and notes you can visit this page or uh, Skillpedia Ansible tutorial introduction and lab setup which is given in the in the description part now this is a complete lecture series you will get the theoretical understanding and to proceed with this what we need to first download you need to download these two images these are ready machines so click on this you will download the machine and this is second machine that is server and tester machines and uh, I'm going to demonstrate these things whatever I explained here with the screenshot with everything you can uh, visit this page for uh, complete understanding one by one now to set up the lab we need to import these two machines which we have downloaded for this install Oracle VM VirtualBox current version as of now is 6.1.12 and to import the machine click on file and import appliance now how to import go and search the machine which you have downloaded the image which you have downloaded the way I just demonstrated alright now go to that and uh, import the machine that is one is server and uh, click on import so select this include all network adapter cards and click on import so first part we will be downloading these machines setting up the uh, machines configuring uh, host only adapter set up the infrastructure required for that Ansible training so we need at least three machines for this training server tester 1 and tester 2 server is going to be our controller node and the tester 1 and tester 2 are going to be our test machines where we are going to push the configuration and verify working of Ansible entire training will be based on these three machines server tester 1 tester 2 so uh, tester 2 machine is simply a clone of uh, tester 1 machine so in the next lab we will discuss the networking part so if you see by the end of this uh, video uh, uh, you should be able to have this machine and uh, download these machines and import these two machines and then create host only adapter if it is not already configured there are more lectures on the skillpedia go to blog now if you look at uh, cloud computing certification training oracle vm virtual box 7 sc linux administration setup puppet master and puppet agent on the cent on centos 8 install configure apache server install uh, uh, centos 8 on uh, oracle vm virtual box centos has arrived and there are more blogs and the corresponding lectures available on that a lot of look at the blog nfs server client configuration ca cga script and uh, sc linux SC Linux policies using a fixed file and setting mount, mount context in, for SC Linux. Look at the so many lectures, so many uh, blogs on LDAP server client, then automated installation using PXC server and all. So, a lot of blogs available on these topics. So, uh, let's see whether our machine is imported or not. Let's wait till the machine is imported. So, our first machine is imported. Let's uh, similarly, let's import the second machine that is tester machine. So go to that machine where you have downloaded it and select the machine image and get a tester machine also. So import this machine. This is basically to save your time in setting up and installing Linux. So this will save your, your lot of time. So our tester machine also imported. Now we need to set up the host only adapter. So for this click on the host only adapter we already have this if you see so if it is not there you can click on create and fill in the details it may give you this warning and then it will create one for you and you can fill in the details just wait and watch you see adapter number three is created so it is, I'm removing it because I know I don't need it now this is the adapter and once you have this you configure manually make these settings if you want to work strictly according to my lab assignment and as per the blog which I have explained so this video is basically supplement to the blog and the demonstration of whatever is discussed and demonstrated in the blog screenshots are taken from this video which are used in the blog also 
all right and then go to the dhcp server configure these settings uh, server address uh, lower bound ip and upper bound ip once you configure this you need to take one more step go to the machine click on settings and then to ensure that on network what you need to have is you have net enabled for the first and second host only adapter and you select the adapter which you have configured like if you already have existing host only adapter and then and and you have configured a new one then you have to select that the one which you have configured from your adapter list and uh, then you can safely start the machine so once it is done you can start the machine and then uh, here also you can go to the settings and verify network first is nat which gives you connectivity to internet and second is a host only adapter which gives you connectivity from one machine to another so uh, once you configured this once you then you can start the machines and our networking will be configured after that so once you have imported that was the first part of the lab how to configure host only adapter and how to import the machines how to set up networking between the machines is the next session all right next video now uh, just take a look at and this first part is uh, we are just working on this introduction in lab setup so by when you complete this lab assignment follow this sequence of steps with theoretical knowledge with background information net and ssh key and all that this is basics you downloaded the machine you imported the machines you set up this uh, host only adapter and uh, this is demonstrates that part and uh, then at the end of it you import the machines and uh, this part uh, this blogs talks about uh, uh, the machine setup once you uh, install this machines you require you know uh, this username is oracle password is oracle so i'm just starting the machine so that i can show you that yes uh, machine is set up and these are adapter settings if it is not configured only which i just demonstrated so let's see if my machine is started so gui machine is coming up linux machine is already started all right so login name is root password is oracle for this remember i'm using oracle linux 7.8 version and ip space a networking part if you see here 10.0.2.15 and 10.10.10.10.0.101 uh, and uh, server machine is having a 10.10.0.100 ip address that uh, networking configuration setting will do in the next steps thank you all for watching subscribe to the channel and uh, please press the bell icon if you want to learn more and subscribe to the skillpedia.com watch complete series and to understand complete ansible tutorial log series thank you